also developing right now an urgent manhunt to find a creepy crook. He used a gas mask to hide his face during a robbery just hours ago. It happened inside the Chevron gas station just before 7 this morning along the 300 block of East Altamont Drive. It's right across from the Altamont Springs Mall there. News 6's Troy Campbell joins us there live with the new surveillance video police want you to see. Troy. Well, Matt and Lisa, in the video, you see that employee look up and discover that someone with a gas mask is standing there right in front of her, eventually the same person who would pistol whip her. Now, tonight, Altamont Springs Police, they're releasing the video. They're trying to get crime results by getting the suspect off the street. In this video captured outside the Chevron gas station near I-4 and State Road 436, time stamped at 623 this morning, you see a man dressed in all black come around the corner, holding a gun to his side and entering the gas station. Inside video shows the employee looking at her cell phone, and then she looks up to see the man with the gas mask and a gun pointed at her. The suspect runs around the corner to get behind the counter, where he quickly focuses on the cash drawer. Attempting to use the key, the drawer doesn't open. The suspect is then seen striking the woman in the face with his handgun. The employee then tries to open the drawer with her cell phone still visible in her hand, but unable to call for help. Seconds later, the drawer flies open. The man is seen grabbing the cash and running out of the store. The employee is then seen realizing she was bleeding when she calls police. And investigators say that employee only had a minor injury, so she was seen at a local hospital. So if anyone knows anything about this or who the suspect is, Ultimate, Altamont Police, they want you to call them, or you can send in an anonymous tip by calling into Crime Line. Lisa, Matt. Troy, thank you.